Hello everyone, this is your daily dose of Geometry Dash. Well, as many of you have noticed lately, I have been avoiding making controversy videos, but I feel like this one is worth bringing up, and you'll understand why later. It all started when this person made this tweet, talking about the level Cosmos. Yes, it appears as though the Cosmos end screen was copied directly from an art, found in the Vsauce video. The image in this video was originally made in 2011, by a person named Tobias Roach. Sorry, I don't know how to say that name. A freelance artist and photographer. This is the comparison between the Cosmos end screen and the original art. For a team this prolific and talented, I'm really disappointed and somewhat disgusted at how blatantly obvious this copying is. There's no mention of the original art either. I'm curious if there will be any response to this. And at the end of the day, it had. Vernam, Cherry Team's owner, responded. When I commissioned the Cosmos end screen from Kim Mystic, I remember that he got this picture from some free stock website. Just to make sure, I found the original artist and got in contact with him to personally ask if he's fine with this specific usage of this BG. Well, this controversy basically ended here, but it did bring up a pretty interesting question to the community. Is it fine to trace art in GD? In the art community, tracing art and using it on your own project is not really well seen by the people, but apparently in Geometry Dash, for many people, it is not the same thing. Kulak says, in my opinion, tracing and copying art is generally kinda lame, unless you are specifically referencing something as part of a theme. It feels like the easy way out and often soars my taste of a level a little. Well, what is your opinion about this topic? I'm very interested to know. FNAF fans will get the reference. Hey, hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. We found some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Yo, this is an interesting concept. I remember I heard this idea in one of Summifying's streams, but what about a trigger called like masking trigger, where an object is only visible if it is intersecting with another object? Well, I think it is really, really interesting. Oh no, that's a horrific car accident. This is the Ultra Particle Accelerator. Join the Discord server in the description if you wanna submit a clip to appear in the next video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.